welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited to uh, uh, film this look for you guys. Okay, if you guys have not already guessed that I am doing an inspired Selena look. <laughs> I know Desi Perkins came out with a look and she did she did amazing. There was a couple of people that said not to do it because she did an awesome job. But you know what? If you do not follow Desi on Snapchat, you guys should follow her. She had said on Snapchat that if they felt like they wanted to do it, if you know Selena inspired them, then to do it, to not be discouraged over what people say. She was actually encouraging people to, you know, I, I thank her for that. I wasn't going to do it, but she inspired me. So, you know, I am, she's probably never going to see this video, but I just want to say, Desi, thank you. Um, I know I'm a, like, I'm nobody, you know, and I just wanted to thank her for that. She just really encouraged anybody to go out for your dreams, do what you love, and don't let anybody hold you back. And I just want to say thank you, Desi, for those inspirating words. So, and yeah, so this is the look, and we're going to go ahead and let's get into the video. Okay, so for this look, I'm so excited. I'm going to start off by priming my face with this Benefit Professional Matte Primer. And then today for foundation, I'm going to use the Maybelline Superstay Foundation. But I'm also going to mix it with my Fit Me Maybelline Matte. As you know, Selena, she's really matte in her face. So I'm going to mix these, but I'm going to use the matte one mostly in my T-zone. We're going to buff it all out using my Real Technique Beauty Blender. Okay, so now that I'm done with my foundation, I am going to use my MAC Concealer, and I am the number NC35. I know MAC came out with the Selena Collection, so I'm going to try to use as many MAC products that I have for this look. Unfortunately, I couldn't get my hands on any of the collection, so I'm going to do my very, very best. Okay, now we're going to move into eyes, and today I'm going to prime my face with the Urban Decay Potion eye primer all the way up to the lid okay so I am going to start off with this MAC fluff color all over my lid I think that's what it's called fluff see my camera I'm first gonna apply it using my MAC SE239 brush. It has a little bit of a shimmer and I'm just going to go ahead and lightly put that on my eyes. I'm only going to use a little bit of product. I'm not going to use too much. I noticed that she really didn't use a lot of eyeshadow. She really kept it natural and she looked beyond gorgeous. So that's what I'm going to try to do. I'm going to blend all this out really quick. I feel like it's too shimmery. And I am using my 217 MAC 217 brush. Okay, for the crease, I am going to use this MAC Espresso color. And I'm going to lay this all over into my crease area. I'm not going to put it on very heavy. I'm just going to keep it light and simple. And I'm going to use back and forth motions. And I'm going to use very little product. And then just blend it all out with my MAC Fluffy brush. Blend out those harsh lines. I'm just going to focus this color mainly on my crease. Okay, so now I'm going to move on to eyeliner. Notice Selena, she has that classic beautiful eyeliner. So today I'm going to use this Aziza eyeliner in black. I'm going to try my very, very best. I really don't wear eyeliner that horrible. But I'm going to try. So 
so far so good can someone tell me why is it so hard to do you do one side really perfect and then when you go on to the other side you're like oh so hard to do the other side <laughs> how <laughs> I haven't done eyeliner in a very 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 long time you know what Surprisingly, I got this eyeliner at the 99 cent store and it's working really good. It's really pigmented. I just don't like the tip of this one. All this for Selena's. <laughs> I can't do eyeliner. <sighs> oh. If you guys haven't seen the movie, you have to see the movie. JLo did such an amazing job. Okay, I feel like that's the best it's going to get. I came out pretty good with considering that I haven't done eyeliner in a super long time, but. I don't know. Okay, so I'm I'm contemplating on the eyebrows. I know she had a really round eyebrow in the beginning and they were mine are really arched and hers were more rounded. So I'm gonna try my very best. Nope. I ain't doing eyebrows. They're too dark. But this can be a chola look. Uh this can be a chola look. Okay, so I am not going to do my eyebrows. It came out horrible. I feel like they're already thick enough. And I feel like if I do do my eyebrows, it's just, girl, it is not working. So I'm just going to keep my eyebrows. I am going to brush them out and make them, you know, as tame as I could. But I ain't going to try to do no eyebrows. And then Selena had beautiful cheekbones. I'm just going to lightly put some blush on. And I am going to use my Velour Powder. Satin blush by Mac just lightly just my cheekbones I'm not gonna go out too much. I want to keep it really really simple. I feel like Selena was naturally beauty She didn't wear a lot of makeup. So I want to keep it. Um, I want to keep them the makeup minimal so for lips Unfortunately, I do not have no Mac red lipsticks, but I do have the Kylie Jenner Let's see the Mary Jo K and I'm going to put this all over my lips without the lip liner. And I noticed Selena's lips were glossy. So I'm going to put a little bit of chapstick over to make give it a little bit of more of a gloss. And if you don't have any red lipstick that you know, MAC came out with, the Selena line, I really feel like this is a really good red for that. Okay, so I had to put on my earrings, you know, I got to get into the feeling. I'm going to use my EOS just to give it that glossy look. And then I'm going to try to attempt to put on eyelashes and I'm going to use these natural looking eyelashes by Kiss. Alrighty guys, that was the complete look of this Selena Inspire look. I really like the high ponytail hair that she had going on. This was such a fun video to film for you guys. Selena inspired me. I used to actually live in Texas when um, I was seven years old. I was that one girl that came to California wearing that shirt with Selena's face on it and everybody looked at me like I was crazy but I didn't care because I I love Selena she inspired me she was all about um inspiring the young girl growing up so um, I just want to thank you guys so much for watching and if you're not subscribed to my channel go ahead and subscribe right below and thank you guys once again and I'll see you guys on my next one bye